What is up? Kragas Gamers here. Uh, and today I'll be going to, t to talk about skills. Um, the skills that I'm going to be referring for is what is called the core skills. And I'll also be talking about what they basically do afterwards. So without further ado, let's get straight to it. The ones are capacitor management, capacitor system operation, CPU management, power grid management, and potion jamming. These are the f uh, the ones that you probably need. Don't take the capacitor mission system. That was for another thing. But uh, the capacitor management. Okay, so the capacitor management uh, regulates the ship uh, the ship's overall capacity, energy capacity, and it gives you a five percent bonus to the capacitor per skill level. So mine's at four at the moment, and that's. Uh, so I have a pretty decent, but okay. Um, capacitor system operation is the how much the actually a recharge takes. So every time that you skill it up, it would it takes a reduction in the recharge by five percent. The CPU management increases your CPU output, and it increases also by five percent per per skill. Uh, that's the power grid management. Basic understanding in ship engine in energy, not engineering, grid system. And that means that it can output more power to the modules per skill level. 5% per skill level. Then that's the proportion jamming. That just means, that just gives you reduction to uh, that give, it means it gives you a reduction to the capacity needed for web scram, web disruption, stasis web, etc. Um, the capacitor emission system is really not needed, but you can skid it up if you. But it's for the emission weapons and etc. So that is basically it. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, and if you have any suggestions, please leave it in the comments below too. Um, and um, that's all I got. Uh, so, see you the next time. Fly safe.